hell yeah, there's a ton of diamond here. Oh my god, yes, this is diamond heaven. Hello everybody, welcome to the cameras. My name is Scott, and welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero, episode 10. So today I really want to find diamonds, and my little brother gave me a tip actually, because he also plays the game, and he's a little bit further than me already. And what he said was that I need to um, pin things I want and that would help me so I'm going to do this I'm going to pin it and apparently it's going to help me I don't know how yet but I'm just going to do it all right so I made an extra thermos just for if we uh, are going on a journey in the ice again uh, yeah let's swap out my battery real quick as well uh, yeah so I'm just going to all kinds of places update you if I find anything and maybe try to, to dive deep enough to go to the uh, artifacts that we already know the locations of. So where is my... there we go. This what I want. Oh, look, I have titanium in my sorry. Just a second. Oh, nope. Be gone. Alright. Uh, take out this bad boy. I really love this locker, by the way. It's... it's oh. It's really nice to have. Alright, take two of these, two of these. Uh, take away my flare, put away my thermos, and my water purification, and one med kit. Yeah, that seems about right. Yeah, this could. I also made a flashlight just in case, so. Nope. And I also know how to fix the sound now. I just need to pick it up real shortly, and then it's gone for the rest of the episode, so that's really nice. Because that was annoying as hell. Alright, so is this thing uh, completely... Okay, let's do this. Yes, okay, so uh, I'm going on an adventure. And I'll see you guys when I see anything interesting. Alright guys, so I'm searching in this volcanically active zone. And it seems that there are all kinds of fragments over here. So I'm just going to do a good old scanneroo real quick. Yeah, okay, I am recording just to make sure. So, sea truck aquarium module. Well, that sounds nice. Then I can store some food or something. What's this? Fabricator module. That's nice. That's always nice to have a fabricator with me. Can't scan this. What's this? Uh, battery. Okay, that's good. Uh, what do we have here? Water. Sea truck. Oh, this is just a regular sea truck. Okay, that's bad. Explosion. Um, I thought I saw a data box. There it is. Alright, what do we've got here? Control room? I have no idea what that is, but it looks like some kind of drone control. Maybe something like the scanner room? Alright, so uh, that was everything in this spot. Oh, I see some lithium. Oh, there's a bunch of lithium here, actually. I kind of want to scan him. I, I'm going to scan him. Can I go for my sea track? No, you aren't. Okay, good. Hello! Please be gentle. Cryptosuchus. Okay, good. He didn't see me. Let's go. <laughs> That was very risky, but I got it. That's nice. Okay, good, good, good. Is he following me? Oh god, he's following me. Oh god. Okay, he stops. I don't like that they have split mouths now. That makes it way creepier than it was. Alright. I have something important to share. Tell me! Another artifact. Yes, although... You cannot know for sure what it is, but it is certainly of significant import. I know. Signal location uploaded to PDA. <laughs> I love Alan, man. So that's the new one, PKA. That seems less deep than this one, so I might go there first. Let's try if I can get down there. I probably cannot get there with the, the uh, sea truck, but I might be able to swim there. So let's see how close we can get. Oh, I see another fragment there. Alright. I hope that sound was. Oh my god. They had tentacle mouths. Oh my god. I don't like that at all. Let's not get too close with my sea truck for that. Alright, so what do we have here? Aquarium module again. So we need one more aquarium module. I see another one there. I'm going to get it. Don't notice me. Don't notice me. Don't notice me. Don't notice me. Right. I'm very peaceful. You're probably not. So let's keep it keep keep our distances, okay? An active volcano detected nearby. Cool. Aquarium module, nice. So we can make an aquarium now. Good, I think. Alright, so let's get back to the sea truck. See if we can get a little bit closer. 
Oh my god, please don't. I don't like these guys at all. They make a lot of sound and that makes me very nervous. Am I recording actually? I think I am, right? Yes, okay, I am. Good. Close. Okay. Where was the artifact? Over there. Okay, so let's just go there. As close as we can get. Alright, this is a terrible idea. This Warning. is a terrible Maximum idea. Death reached. Hull damage imminent. Right above it. So, this is a terrible idea. Just parking my ship in the middle of nowhere with big shadows all around. I can't see anything. But this seems a relative safe spot, so let's do this. Repair you real quick. Alright, let's get down. This... Oh my god. Oh 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 god. No. 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 Please don't. I have an appointment with BK-8. Don't follow me. Don't consume me, please. Okay. It seems like we can get here. Yeah, yeah, I think we're fast enough. Okay. So what do we've got? Oh, I see rubies. That's good, that's good. I'm going to take some of those with me. Because those are quite rare right now for me. Alright. Ruby, 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 ruby. I see some lithium as well, but I'm not going to take too my the time. The artifact you found contains traces of information suggesting what has become of my people. Is it diamond? Yes! Diamond! Good! I found my first diamond. Nice, nice, only one more. Okay, so I might... There's not a diamond there. Oh, damn, there are all kinds of diamonds here. Hell yeah. Okay, I'm going to pick up some oxygen first, and then I'm going down here again, so... Uh, up, 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 up,
please don't eat me, please don't eat me, please don't eat me, please don't eat me. Oh, I don't like that sound at all. And his tentacle mouth is also very disturbing. So go in, go Only in. 30 seconds yes, yes, yes. I'm going up and I'm going away. Where is my home? There it is. Okay, everybody. So I'm getting out of this biome as quick as possible. And nice. I'm just going toward my base and build, build the stuff we need to progress the story. So we'll see you guys soon. And I'm going, not going close to you, whatever you are. Is that Karar? Oh my god. Some kind of will thing. But does he have Karar? I see like these green bulges on his... Hmm. It's something to uh, yeah, maybe analyze later, but not now. I don't want to lose this thing now. Alright, so see you guys in the next shot. So hi everybody, I'm back to the base and I now have the materials to make, first of all, glass. Second of all, two of these normal glass. So I think I had... Wait, I think I have that over here, actually. Yeah, I think I put... Rare, yeah, okay, so here I have the plasteel ingot. So right now I can unping what I was doing because I found it. Um, I don't know if it actually helped me, but uh, sea truck, aquatic module, yeah. So where the hell was this thing? Recyclotron. Recycles items into their constituent parts. Oh my god, that is great. That is absolutely great. I want that. I want that. I want that as well. Okay, so that's one of these and one of these. So, first of all, let's make the depth module. Nice. And then I think... Let's just uh, grab this one real quick. Release it. Yes. Okay, so let's put it here. It looks pretty good. Nice. Allows for the recycling of natural resource components without rinsing and sorting them into bits first. Nice. I really like this. Good. So we have the materials uh, we need now. We've got the depth module. Yeah, we're good. We're really good right now. Good. Okay. So right now we can go deeper, guys. Good. So what does this increase it to? 300 meters, so that's great because that was the depth I was just at. So right now I can go way deeper. All right, so how do I upgrade that? That's the real question. So we can make the modification station now. So that's really nice because this means we can now upgrade our knife, first of all. We just got a battery, so that's great. Let's just do this. Man, everything is just working out perfectly right now. Good. Love this episode. Okay, so we have this extra battery we found in a box. So now we can upgrade our knife. Nice, we've got a thermo blade. Looks good, looks good. Okay, so then we've got the depth upgrade. So we need anomal glass, synthetic fibers, and rubies. We can make anomal glass. We have rubies. Can we make synthetic fibers? That's the real question. I don't have nickel, so this one is probably not going to happen. But I don't know all the ingredients for that yet. So, um... Fibers, how do I make those? Synthetics probably. Fibers. Spiral plant clipping. And a ruby. Hmm, I don't know where the hell I would find these spiral plants. Let's see if I got uh, data about that. Um, maybe also, uh, I will just show these real quick. So, oh. Made of deposit that often contains silver and titanium. Often gold and titanium. So highly reactive non-metallic elements usually found in the abundance underground. Common applications include production of acidic compounds and combustibles. Okay, uh, Chelina uh, contains lead and titanium, hydrothermal spire. These chimney-shaped structures are formed from dissolved minerals pushed upward through the planet's crust. The presence of metal sulfides gives the escaping material its dark, opaque appearance. Aquatic life found in their proximity may have evolved adaptations to the presence of these toxic compounds. Assessment long-term exposure to geothermal emissions may pose a risk to human health. Limestone, titanium and copper. All right, ore vein. Resources behind loose rock. Yes, I gathered. Uh, a hard blood red gemstone made of aluminum oxide. Rubies may be processed in order to leverage their structural integrity in advanced vehicle construction and modification. Good. Okay, so I'm not going to do all the um, 
in the in the uh, fauna yet, but I'm going to go look through flora. So see, what were we looking at exactly? What do we need? Wait, just a second. Um, oh, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. Okay, uh, spiral plants clipping. Uh, let's see if I got any information about spiral plants. Spiral plants. No spiral plants here in C. Land them maybe? No, exploitable. It probably will be in this exploitable one, right? Because we have uh, creep fine, kelp species, concentrate large forest, shallow waters, yes. Rich in iron, making it both viable base material for fabrication of textiles as well as basic food stuff. Okay, gel sack, scanning structures grow cave walls, purple sacks, blah blah blah. Okay, honeycomb fungus. This hardly fungus erupts through the thick ice shelf. It sends a collection of hypea filament that collects nutrients and moisture deep into the ice shelf until it hits per permafrost. From there, the hypea. IVA intertwine into a thick root-like system called mycelia cords. So that's fungus, basically. These mycelia effectively pull nutrients from the soil. Okay, sulfur plant. Yeah, explosive. We know what those do. Okay, but it doesn't seem that I know where these red plants are. I need right. Yeah. Okay. So I've no. But how did I get the uh, fabrication thing then? Spiral plant clipping. I'm just going to pin the recipe. Um, I'm going to unpin the enamel glass uh, recipe because I don't need that right now. Enamel glass. All right. So, anyways, I think this is a good end for this episode. Then, then next episode, I think it will be smart to go and start looking for this plant first of all, and second of all, um, gather some new quartz. I need that, but I do that off screen. And, um, yeah, go deeper, because now we finally can go deeper with the new, um, yeah, with the new things we have. So that's really good. I like this. We need only find two more artifact sites, and we can probably go here now. So that is good. Well, yeah, so we'll do that next episode. So hope you guys all like, yeah, it's a control room. Serving a managed habitat power structure. Enter. So it is different. Interesting. Alright, but that's not for now. So, I hope you guys all like this episode. Uh, I told you what we're next episode we're going to do. Uh, if you like the episode, please consider leaving a like and subscribing. So you can um, yeah, follow me on this great adventure we are having right now. And uh, yeah, leave a comment down below if you have any hints uh, of where to look or what to do in the game. Or maybe just hints about cool games I get to play. And then uh, I'll see you in the next episode. So, bye bye!